you need a good quality condenser mic for around 2000 pesos stick around i might just have a good recommendation that is worth buying what is up guys it's your boy kim back again with a new video kamusta kayong lahat I hope you're doing okay. Kung bago ka sa channel ko, first of all, welcome. I usually make home workout videos that are suited for beginners. Kaya kung ganong videos ang gusto mo, please consider subscribing. Malaking tulong yun sa akin. Pero kung matagal ka na sa channel ko, as you might have noticed, iba ang style ng video ko for today. Simula ngayon, ito try ko i-mix up ang content ko here and there. What I have for you guys today is an equipment that is worth investing on if ever you want to buy a good budget microphone that is gonna be used for work, for school, for streaming, or just simply a hobby. I'm talking about the Maono AU A03 condenser microphone. So I bought this one from Lazada for around 2,000 pesos which is a pretty reasonable price. Kapag naganap ka kasi ng good quality microphone, usually 5,000 or sometimes about 10,000 pesos. Pero dun lang tayo sa mid-tier ng presyo pagdating sa purpose at quality niya. So why did I buy this? For one, obviously I'm going to use it to make videos because I want to deliver quality content let alone the audio part. Yung isa pang reason is I'm planning to stream. I love playing games so why not share it with you guys. Abangan nyo malapit na. So, enough about that. What do you actually get right off the box? As you open the box, you will see two items. First one is the anti-wind foam. Basically, this foam is designed to reduce the noise of the air moving directly over the microphone that are usually coming from the surroundings or from the user. The second one is called the pop filter, which is used for filtering out the popping sounds, usually from the certain letters such as P, B, T. Also, this comes with a gooseneck which gives you the ability to freely set it towards the microphone. Underneath that layer, you will then see the rest of the items. This one is called the table clamp. Self-explanatory, this will serve as the primary attachment to the table, at the same time the foundation of the whole microphone setup. Have this part placed on the side of the table, then simply tighten the grip. There's also a slot right here that is intended for the next item, which is the microphone stand, also called the boom arm. This is the movable part which allows you to reposition the microphone. It is made of pure metal which provides the stability to the setup. The shaft right here goes to that slot from the table clamp. Next to that is the shock mount, which fastens the actual microphone at the same time isolates it from unwanted movements and vibrations. There is a clip here that you need to pinch first to be able to slide the mic in. The next one is an XLR to 3.5mm audio cable which I really appreciate because I myself have devices that utilizes the 3.5mm audio jack which means there's no need for an adapter or additional device. And last but not the least, the condenser microphone. The microphone itself doesn't feel as light though. It actually feels very premium in my opinion. It has a metallic grille and a matte black finish which adds to the professional look. Plus the Mayono signature logo and its body. So these are the accessories worth mentioning. This is the Y adapter that is typically used for devices that have integrated audio jacks. Pwede ito gamitin mostly sa mga modern laptops. Basically, its job is to separate the connection of the mic input and the speaker output. These are the cable straps used for cable management. And this is the spec sheet. Now that we are done checking out the different parts of the kit, let's check out the specs of the microphone. The microphone core is a 16mm diameter condenser. Its polar pattern is cardioid. This is how it looks like. The shape defines certain areas where the microphone will pick up the sound the most. Frequency response is from 30Hz up to 16kHz. Sensitivity is negative 38 decibels plus minus 3 decibels wherein 0 decibels is equal to 1 volt per pascal at 1kHz. The max sound pressure level is 120 decibels which is pretty decent. The signal to noise ratio is 70 decibels. Electrical current is 3 mA. The voltage it produces is 1.5 volts. Color is black and the material is metal.
Okay, nice. Let me just say, I already feel like a DJ right now. I mean, come on, it's my first time to own this type of mic. Ooh, okay. I think everything is set. The next part would be the moment you've all been waiting for, which is the testing phase. So, just a little piece of info you might need. There is actually a portion of the mic that you need to face kapag ginagamit mo. Yung part na may logo, yun dapat yung nakaharap sa'yo. Kasi hindi porket ito yung top portion, ito na yung mismong part na dapat nakaputok sa'yo. Meron siya specific na area, ulitin ko guys. So with that out of the way, let's start the testing phase. Okay, for this one, co-connect lang natin siya sa mic. No filter, no processing, just raw sound coming from the mic. This is a sound test using the Maono AUA03. Nakakonect sa aking laptop. Raw sound siya. Walang processing. I will stay quiet for a few seconds para malaman natin kung gano'n siya kasensitive sa white noise sa paligid. I will now move slowly away from the microphone. Tignan natin kung mag-fade away din yung tunog ko. Then, daan-daan akong babalik. Tignan natin kung lalakas yung nare-receive niyang tunog. Ngayon, daan-daan akong magsasalita sa gilid ng microphone. Ngayon, nagsasalita na ako sa likod ng microphone. I'm Sarge Wild Manila. Please subscribe to my channel. Now, this is me talking to the front side of the microphone kung saan nakalagay yung logo. I'm now going to make unnecessary noise on purpose para malaman natin kung gano'n siya ka-sensitive. So this is me aggressively typing with one hand on the keyboard. Now this is me aggressively typing on the keyboard with two hands. Now I'm going to use a pop filter to see if it will filter out the unnecessary sound that it will have to take. So I'm gonna say such words such as pop, bob, balloon, Bentley. Is it doing its job? Please let me know in the comments. That is the sound test for the Maono AUA03 without any audio processing. Mic check 1, 2, 3. Mic check 1, 2, 3. Okay, for this one, ginamitan na natin ng filter and audio processing itong Maono AUA03. This is a sound test using the Maono AUA03 with audio processing and filtering. Dahan-dahan ako atras pala yun sa mic. Tignan natin kung ma-pick up pa rin niya to. Then, dahan-dahan akong lalapit ulit sa microphone. Typing aggressively ulit ako sa microphone. Tignan natin kung marinig niya. Tatahiming ako na ilang segundo para malaman natin kung gano'n siya ka-sensitive sa white noise. Pop. Bob. Balloon. Mic check 1, 2, 3. Mic check 1, 2, 3. So guys, that concludes my unboxing plus review of the Mono AUA03 condenser microphone. I want to know what you guys think of this condenser microphone. Leave them in the comments below. Is it good? Is it too good for its price? Is it just another average microphone that is overpriced? To be honest, I'm pretty excited using this microphone for my next videos. Also guys, let me know what you guys think about this video style I'm doing. As I said earlier, I'm trying to mix up my content here and there from now on. Again, this is your boy Kim. Have a nice day. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys later.